two people died and a third was critically injured in an explosion in Ethiopia's capital on Sunday, Addis Ababa's police said. Two people died and a third was critically injured in an explosion in Ethiopia's capital on Sunday, Addis Ababa police said. The police blamed the explosion on hand grenades that went off in Ledita area of the city in the afternoon and said they were investigating. Ethiopia sent its troops to the northern region of Tigray in early November to fight against Tigray People's Liberation Front. Then the regional ruling body, which had attacked army bases in the region, the TBLF, withdrew from the regional capital of Bakale before the end of the month, and the Ethiopian government declared victory. In similar story, Ethiopia has declared a state of emergency in the southern part of Amaru regional state amid violence in various towns. In a statement on Sunday, the Ministry of Defense said the last three days have seen deadly armed violence in the entire town on several areas in Oromia's special zones. The statement said a new specified number of people were killed in days of armed attacks by gunmen in those areas, and sizable properties were destroyed. Many civilians fled the armed conflict, and the statement said, identifying the perpetrators and anti beast elements, it said it no army traffic will be allowed to pass through the road from Debri Sina town in northern Shiwa to Kalbolcha town. It suggested the involvement in the finance of government structures across travel central areas of the country that are situated only about 250 kilometers from the capital, Addis Ababa. The area in question are one is inhabited by Amara and Oromia ethnic groups. The statement said there are forces working to bet the two ethnic groups against each other. It said the Federal Army, in collaboration with the people, were successfully working to quell violence in several other places across the country.